ladies and gentlemen, <clears throat> this is a, a new radio in my collection. It's a really new radio? Yes. Ha! <laughs> this is a Superstar 360 FM MK1. This is the very first Superstar 360 FM MK1 with a PC879 PCB by Uniden. It's a little bit different to the newer MK2 with PB010 board here. Yes, uh, it's the frequency range and it's uh, it's the Roger beep. We we will take a look here on the radio. Um, the squelch volume RF gain uh, mic gain here. Um, this is the channel 1 to 40 on wake it and this here is the 10 meter span yeah. 10 meter span is here um, uh, very special on this radio okay here we go back uh, here on channel 16 here AM FM USB LP. And now how how sounds the old Roger Peep? How sounds the old Roger Peep? Oh, hang on. Yeah, I will send here. It's a very special sound. And now I go on USB. And here on my receiver on USB. And now I will sound again. Special sound here. And on LSB. It's, it's a little bit different between LSP and USB again on LSP here and on USB it's a it's a very special rocket here yes. now uh, we will uh, we will look the difference between the Superstar 360, the Superstar 360 FM MK1 and the MK2 a little bit later here. Uh, okay, okay, now I'm back here. These are three superstars, but three different ones. This is a Superstar 360 without FM. Where is the FM? No. FM and this is the Superstar 360 FM MK1 the older one with the special Roger beep and this is the newer one MK2 with the PB010 by Uniden now we will turn it back so We can see the oldest superstar without FM is from 1979. The second, the Superstar 360 MK1 is from 1980 and the MK2 is from 1981 we can see this number here the first number is the manufacture year okay here we can see the screws here they are far different to the other superstars with FM the MK1 here we can see the driver and final they are very near together here and on the Superstar MK2 
driver and final is a little bit wider here okay and now we will look into the box into the case mm -hmm. yes I'm back here yes this are Superstar 360 this without FM the old one 360 FM MK1 and here 360 FM MK2 Yes, okay, we will look here. Ah. Ah. The old Superstar. It's so dark here. Yes. So, the old Superstar 360 without FM uh, includes here an additional crystal board or additional oscillator board and this board makes me three stacks with 40 channels about uh, totally uh, 120 channels with this oscillator board here yes the oscillator board comes from here so and this is an old you need to print here um, uh, very similar with President Grant first uh, edition here uh, with MB 8719 PLL synthesizer on this place here okay and now uh, we will look here on the FM first Superstar 360 FM yes and uh, we can see here these three oscillators low medium high channel and if we take here the new one uh, we can see uh, a little bit different here the oscillator we have just one oscillator here one oscillator for all the 120 channel but what's new here we have here a Motorola PLL synthesizer and two full adders here digital full adders um, it's possible to make 512 channels with this um, with, with this circuit here 512 channels are possible to make with this chassis here yes um, that's a different uh, look here a little bit in the box and we can see here uh, more differences but all in all is it the uh, similar print here the PA on this side here the PA on this side is uh, very similar with the PA from the MK2 here and uh, and the final circuit here with the mixer on the mixer here the SSB mixer here on this side the TX mixer and on this side it's uh, very uh, similar and all the position of the transformers and coils are um, identical yes Okay, I think uh, that's all here at uh, this time. Eh? Thank you very much for uh, for your visit here.